Hello everyone, and welcome to Power Pages Tips. My name is Nicholas Hayduk, and this is tip number 294. Call the Web API. Continuing our series on the Power Pages Web API, in this tip, let's look at the JavaScript required to call the Web API. Before we dive into the details, don't forget to subscribe to the Engineered Code YouTube channel for our weekly tips, monthly community calls, and lots of other Power Pages and Power Platform content. To call the Power Pages Web API from your JavaScript, you'll use Ajax to make the request to the Web API URL. The Web API is hosted on your Power Pages site itself, with a relative base URL of just slash underscore API. So, if you're calling the API from your site, to get a list of contacts, the URL is simply slash underscore API slash contacts. While you can use whichever Ajax technology you'd like, such as vanilla JavaScript, jQuery's Ajax function, a library in React, etc., there is one trick you need to know. In order to successfully call the Power Pages Web API, you need to provide an anti cross site request forgery token. This is passed in via the underscore underscore request verification token header. Luckily, Microsoft provides us the code to retrieve this token. Within the window object, there is a shell object that has a function called get token deferred. This function returns a promise that, once fulfilled, provides the caller with a valid token that can then be included in your Ajax call as the underscore underscore request verification token header. To make things even easier, Microsoft provides some sample code on Microsoft Learn that handles all of this. Simply paste this code into your site and then make your Ajax calls using the web API dot safe Ajax function. This function accepts an object containing the standard jQuery Ajax function options. In our next tip, we'll look at the various HTTP methods supported by the Power Pages Web API to interact with Dataverse data. Thanks for watching, and I hope you found the Power Pages tip number 294 on Call the Web API useful.